Dr. Earl S. Weldon, a towering figure in the history of Seminole State College. He was a pioneering educator and a pathfinder, creating Central Florida's first public two-year college and leading it to greatness over the next 30 years. But he was not alone. His entire family shared that journey every step of the way. I'm Steve Weldon. And I'm Janice Weldon Hickson. You know, I was four years old. I didn't have a concept of a job or, or anything special that was happening. Um, it was just uh, some place that Dad went every day and, and, and something he was doing. You remember when Dad came up with the logo for the college? The diagonal with the S and the torch in the middle, that was Dad's creation. That's what he wanted. And the colors of the navy blue and the light blue. I think people were pretty impressed with the college and really happy to have the opportunity that their kids could go to a homeschool college for two years where they didn't have to go away, that you were still involved in a small campus with, you know, a smaller class, so you didn't, weren't a number. The entire faculty and staff was pretty close-knit group, so uh, they were easy to talk to um, and easy to identify with because it started out as a brand new school, everybody felt like that they were contributing something. Along with thousands of employees and more than one million students over the past 50 years, the Weldon family can look back with pride on all that has been accomplished and look ahead to the future filled with promise. Well, I guess the college has really been, you know, part of our lives growing up. It's something that, that we've always thought of and, and something that, we've always been there for and has always been there for us. It's a great school and it's always had the foresight of what's in the future. What started as a small little bunch of portables in an orange grove grew to this massive campus and has helped so many people to get the education that they wanted. It's amazing to see what you know what we've done in, in, in the 50 years that we've been here and, uh, and how much of an effect that we've had on, on the community. That, Sanford at large um, in Seminole County. Um, I'm interested to see what happens next. From our family to yours, thank you for sharing Earl Weldon with us and for sharing in his vision, his journey, and his legacy. <laughs>